Hey, Roger Brown here, UMG Energy. It's a bright, sunny day in Atlanta, and I want to talk to you about your Rolodex and your contact list and the power in it. I talk about this a lot because you and I have the opportunity to help a lot of people, help a lot of people save money, and help ourselves at the same time by thinking about our contact list that we've built up over years and years probably of working on other things. So we've built a lot of good rapport with people and a way to look at it is now it's time to monetize that Rolodex or monetize that contact list uh, for the good of all involved. And what do I mean by that? We should be only representing things to other people that we have either personally used ourselves or that we have vetted through someone else that we trust. And if we adopt that mindset and we think about the fact that we owe the people that are on our contact list, we owe them uh, that. We owe them the, the, the courtesy if we know things that would benefit them, not things that we're just slinging mud against the wall, but things that we know would benefit them, we owe that as a friend and a contact and a colleague to at least let them know about it and let them check it out for themselves. That's the basis of our business model. We have a very, very uh, low upfront requirement uh, business model that you can recommend, but you can, you can do this with any number of things to your audience. Uh, and it can provide a tremendous benefit for your, uh, for your contacts and your clients, but it can also provide a lifestyle enhancement for you. I mean, concentrated uh, on, on concentrating on your contact list or your Rolodex and supplying them with goods and services that you trust uh, and getting paid for that, which you should, can provide a tremendous lifestyle uh, that you can take advantage of vacations and do whatever you want all over the world because nobody cares where any of us are anymore. Uh, those days are gone. You can operate from the Caribbean or the mountains or your home or wherever you want. So think about that and think about the, the resource that you have in this contact list and think about what can you do for these contacts? What goods and services do you use or do you know of that are trustworthy that you can bring to them and let them know about and develop a, a referral partner relationship with these goods and service providers uh, beforehand? Uh, and there's nothing wrong at all with, with taking part in that revenue stream. If you're bringing value to somebody and you are you are providing value for the vendor who's supplying the service as well, you should be paid for it. Take care.